YouTube, what is going on guys and welcome back to another video guys. This is Boruto. Naruto Next Generation's chapter. What's this? What's what's this? What's this chapter, man? Because we, we got so many chapters. This is 67 already. We on chapter 67 and we're gonna hop into it right after this. Alright guys, we are back. Yo, this chapter, like I said, I've been coming late with these chapters and it's for a reason, okay? I don't want anybody to, to think, oh, you're not staying up on top of your video. No, nothing like that. I need time to process these analysis and make sure that I'm getting it right because at the end of the day, I got to get the information to you guys in the correct form and manner so you guys know what's exactly going on. So, let's break down, alright? What's going on? All right. Last chapter, Boruto was completely dead. We've seen it with our own eyes, but we also know that given the time skip of the future, when they, uh, Kawaki and Boruto, when they fight, when they're about 16, 17 years old. So we do know that this right here is foolproof. Um, as well as the fact of the matter, we knew Boruto was going to be saved. We just did not know how. If you guys remember my last video, we predicted it, y'all. We predicted it. The very first, remember, I gave you three different analogies on what could possibly happen to Boruto, okay? The first one being the weakest, which was uh, Sasuke using Rene Rebirth or being able to sacrifice or anybody sacrificing their life in order to give to Boruto, okay? That was the least expected. The second least expected was the fact that Amado or Orochimaru, being the top scientist in the village, would turn Boruto into some sort of ninja tool, okay? But that would be more of, I would say that would be more towards Amado and Katasuke's side, you feel what I'm saying, more than Orochimaru. Uh, because Orochimaru is more of the experimenting type, he, he more of the old school science while Katasuke and, and Amado, they more of the new future te technology and stuff. The very first option I gave y'all was the fact that Momoshiki would be the one to save Boruto and it has been confirmed. Momoshiki has saved Boruto. How? Boruto he explains to him that he was already at 82% completion Otsuki form. But because of this fate, Momoshiki had to use the last 18% in order to copy Boruto's data in order to reform his lungs and his heart and repaired the hole in his chest, okay? So we predicted it, Momoshiki was the one to save, but here is the crazy part, because Momoshiki used that last 18% on Boruto's data and not his own, he cannot be resurrected. I repeat, he cannot be resurrected. So what is the point of this video? You've seen it in the title. I'm looking at Momoshiki, or should I say Boruto, using Momoshiki, this is just, I feel like this is a rehash of Jinchuriki, okay? Uh, just using gods, all right? Um, now, a lot of people may be thinking I'm wrong here, but let's continue on. So as we continue, Boruto, before Boruto even awakes, Naruto's in shock. Kawaki is now taking on cold, and when I say he's washing cold, like washing this man, we see, we see Kawaki using Ishiki's movesets like it's his own like he like he's the one who manifested it using sukihana on the claw marks when Cole tried to escape he made him small enough so small to the point that Cole couldn't pass through all right my man's kawaki is dangerous bro walked up on him pow slapped me even gold was in the back of his head like damn i hate to admit it but kawaki is stronger than me all right this man's stronger than me. So as they're battling, we get a we get a close-up on Naruto and Shikamaru's conversation. Naruto is in a state of shock. He just lost his boy, okay? Shikamaru, I would say this really brought some character development more out of Naruto. For the simple fact of the matter, we did not get to see him just as a Hokage here. We got to see him as a father, okay? And that was a great part because Shikamaru was thinking... We know he's intellectual, he's intelligent, but he's thinking in the role of a ninja, as a shinobi. 
You gotta snap out of it, Naruto. Your son is dead. He's done. We gotta do something about it. Naruto snaps. Enough. This is my son we're talking about. You hear? You feel me? I don't know what to do. I don't know how to process. But us being shinobi right now is not gonna help. You feel what I'm saying? That's not helping. So, I really adored seeing that out of Naruto. While in the background, Kawa keeps slapping code around. But see, here's the thing though. Here's the thing. Okay? Kawaki is very, very powerful. Okay? Now, Code, on the other hand, he pulled a little trick out of his sleeve. Or should I say out of his head? Out of the claw mark. My man's, yo, Kawaki, if he would have connected with this attack, there would have been no Code, bro. There would have been no Code. Like, he decimated everything. But see, he made an explosion, but Kawaki was blown back. We didn't understand why Kawaki was blown back until the next panel when we actually got to see. Code was smart. He pulled out Damon. Now, if you guys remember, about a couple chapters ago, I'd say a good four chapters ago, we got introduced to Damon and what his power set really is. He's a reflector. Okay, anything you think of, you can think of killing it. If he catches wind of it, you're dead. Any way that it's pretty much mirroring. If I think of chopping your head off, it's gonna happen to me. If I think of shooting you in your head, it's gonna happen to me. You feel what I'm saying? That is Damon's power set. So when Kawaki was blown back by the massive explosion he caused, it was because Kawaki, I mean, uh, Cole was smart, pulled out Damon, okay? Now, Ida was pretty furious about this. You ain't getting no permission. You, you know what I mean? You bringing out my little bro and stuff. You feel what I'm saying? Chill. And, and, and it's going to be even worse for you, bro, if <laughs> Kawaki's dying. Because I'm going to just order Damon to come over and kill you. And there's nothing you can do about it. You feel what I'm saying? Damon is very, very dangerous, okay? Now, here's the thing. Cold understands he's no match for Kawaki at this point, okay? So, his initial reaction is this. He's going to flee and force Amado some way, somehow, to remove the limiters in his body. The only problem with that is, how is Code going to get in, okay? And Ida has to reinform him the fact that, <laughs> bro, you ain't got no claw, mark, claw marks in the actual village. Like, you ain't got none. They all on the outskirts, bro. So, how you going to get Amado? And plus, you know, Amado is actually protected. You feel what I'm saying? How that will work? This is what I predict. I feel like Damon is going to play a big role in the next chapter, considering the fact that he is a reflector and most of the Shinobi are going to try and kill Code. okay? So using Damon and I think that this will be a great time to actually introduce Damon and put him on the battlefield because at this point, he's pretty useless right now. You feel what I'm saying? Like him getting introduced is cool, but he's pretty useless. Um, there's like, come on, like, there's nothing for him to do right now, okay? But, like I said, my prediction is this. We're gonna talk more about it, but it's just in the title. Now that Momoshiki cannot be resurrected, he also did state to Boruto that even though he can't be resurrected, you still did not win, okay? The fact of the matter is this. You, even though that 18% was still converted into your data, you are still 100%. It still adds. So pretty much, think of it this way. He still had 18% left, but it's like Momoshiki was just like, you know what, I'm gonna give him this 18% and just make it his, so it's the full 100. But the last 18 out of the 100 is this man's data. Which means, now that your Otsusification is still 100% as a whole, adding that 18%, he's now divine enough to be fed to the tree, okay, to the ten tails, all right, to culminate the divine tree, all right, so, with that being said, we still have some problem, okay, going on, the fact of the matter that Boruto is now Otsutsuki, he can now be fed to the, to culminate a good fruit, all right, so, that is going to be something different, but, like I said, the main thing I want to talk about that will probably be coming up later on in the next coming chapters before the time skip. I think Boruto's a Jinchuriki, alright? Without having a tailed beast, alright? So guys, 
If you enjoyed this video, you already know what to do. Don't be afraid to hover and want that like button. Subscribe today to become part of the Soul Gang team. Never left. Let's get it. Tap that notification bell to know each and every time that I'm uploading videos. And guys, remember to be good at the game. You gotta kill with skill. And until our next nightmare. Peace, guys.